in Cleveland are on the hunt for a bank robber tonight, but it's the suspect's distinguishing wardrobe that is leading investigators to believe, to believe that this may not be his first strike. News Channel 9's Alyssa Sperato is here to tell us why. Alyssa. Natalie, police got the call around 11.30 this morning after they say a man entered the FSG bank on Keith Street Southwest, got the money, and then took off. But what he was wearing sounds very familiar to investigators in other cities as well. You know, we do know it's a male, so obviously he didn't do too good of a job. Not even police are impressed with the getup of a man who got away. The shoulder-length black wig with gold highlights didn't hide the fact it was not a woman who held up this FSG bank on Key Street Southwest in Cleveland. He walked into the bank. He actually left with an undisclosed amount of money. Um, he left on foot. He traveled across this parking lot here, went through the trees that are in that tree line there, and, um, and disappeared. But long after he slipped out of sight, police are still talking about what sets him apart. Yeah, it is strange. Um, it could be the way of dress for this this uh, male, or it could be just um, you know something to cover up and, and hide his face. But it doesn't appear the first time his fashion faux pas was caught on camera. Why? Just look at this picture. This is surveillance picture of a man who robbed a region's bank just last week. After he escaped, a number of leads led police to the downtown Motor Inn. But after a standoff and search, there was no suspect inside, leading Cleveland police to wonder if their city was next on his hit list. Officers just uh, scanning the area. Um, we did have a couple people that I would say that he passed, so witnesses in this parking lot. Bruce Frazier with the Dalton Police Department say investigators are well aware of today's robberies and are currently in talks with the Cleveland Police Department to find out for sure if this man is that same suspect. Natalie. All right, Alyssa, thanks so much.